Hey, Scott Sager, I'm here at the uh, 2017 Chili Cook-Off and Red Hot Car Show. We've got lots of interviews for you today, lots of great events happening. The 5K run already happened with the United Way. Chili folks been out here since 6 a.m. trying to do their thing. Uh, a lot of fun. So we're going to interview some of those folks. We'll take a look right here on RTC TV4. Okay, Scott Sager. Well, if uh, I'm surrounded by ghouls and chili, you know I'm at one place. That's the annual chili cook-off and red-hot car show in downtown Rochester. Today we've got a great group from the Big R stores. Who do we have here? I'm Gus. Cindy. David. Shell. Kyle. Kyle back there in the mask, right? <laughs> okay. Couldn't hear him through the mask. Well, uh, this, this is your first year to do the uh, chili cook-off? As a group of us, yes it is. Excellent. You having fun so far? Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. So what's the theme? Actually, we were trying to think of a different name for a farmer. Okay. Well, a reaper came up and we kind of went the opposite way. So gotcha. this is our little cemetery. Nice little cemetery here. Well, the Big R stores in Rochester. Thanks so much for being out here today. Have a lot of fun. Hope you sell some chili, okay? Thank you. Thank you all. Well, here we are again. This is a much recognizable booth, but uh, they haven't been around for a few years. I've got Erica Heidi here with RTC. Erica, the booth, the RTC crew, we're back this year. We are back. Yeah. Any? Uh, did it take any special motivation to get the group uh, all back together? Well, we did a chili cook-off in office, which got people pretty excited, and we just got a great crew. So well, you got a good crew. They're working hard today, as you can tell right behind me. Now, the chili, this has to be made from scratch right here on site, correct? From scratch. All we can do is chop vegetables, measure out some of the seasonings, and that's about it. And the rest has to be done here at the chili cook-off, so it truly is a competition. I see some uh, adult beverages there maybe going into this chili a little bit. There is some beer going into the chili. Had to double check, make sure that was okay, yeah. and it is. Excellent, excellent. Most of that alcohol is going to cook off, but give it a great yep. flavor, right? Yep. Well, who's on your team this year? Well, we've got Greta Lynch, Karen Collins, Scott Zion, who is turned around here. He's doing his taste test. Chelsea Jameson on loan from First Fed. Excellent. And then we do have Tammy Pollock, who is off right now, and Emily Bailey, who will be and coming Sharon. in. And Sharon was here this morning to set up. It's Sharon Morris. I saw her as, as I was coming up. So a great team, a, a big team uh, group effort, so to speak, here. What do you think about this for the community? I think it's one of the best events we do. I think it's great. I think it's great that we have extended the amount of booths. It looks like we've got a lot of vendors from a lot of different areas. We saw the Igloo from Silver Lake. Yeah. Um, I don't know where Round Barn Creamery is, but in addition to Sally's, that's three ice cream places from all over. So That's fantastic. Well, it's, it's going to turn out to be one of the biggest events they've ever had downtown here. A d record numbers of crowd today with the number of cars that they brought in from the Blacktop Cruisers Car Club. They've got more chili contestants than ever, so a great day down here in downtown yes. Rochester. Thanks yes. for your time. Thank you. All right. Well, here we've got a team. Uh, this team's from Life Care right here in Rochester. Who do we have today? Becca Stacy. Who's hiding back there? <laughs> Rhonda Schiffro. Rhonda. Terry McCune. Janet Shaver. Excellent. So is this your first year to have a team, or you had a team every year? Is this an annual thing? Um, this is our second year that I know of that we have a team. <laughs> great, great. So uh, what's, the, what's the secret to the recipe here today? I see chilies everywhere. Is it uh, sweet or is it more of a hot and spicy? More than hot and spicy, but the secret ingredient yesterday, Terry was announced that we couldn't put it on paper, and that was love. <laughs> love, always the special ingredient. Well, thanks for coming out and being a part of this great event. Uh, it's a great community event, one of the biggest we have in town, so we're glad you guys are a part of it. Good job to Life Care. Thanks so much for being here today. Thank you. We've got a new or another team. I've interviewed these guys many times, but I'm seeing a new sign up there this year. Yeah, my partner from last year retired. Okay, so what used to be two guys? Yeah, it's now Lake Bruce Garage okay. Chili Team. Lake Bruce Garage Ch Chili Team. I don't know, but. If I'm getting chili from a garage, it's probably pretty darn good. We hope so. <laughs> <laughs> so your, your partner retired. You got a new guy yeah. over here. Yeah, I hired in him. Excellent. That's Dale. Actually, a couple years, actually. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I'm the, um, I'm the Mexican help. <laughs> he's, he's, manual labor. He's manual labor. Up, mixing it up and everything else. Well, excellent. Well, it's good to see you back. Even though you had a partner retire, you got uh, yeah. you kept the ball rolling. You're back this year. Yeah. Now, you've won this thing before, correct? Yeah, about three times we yeah. came in first. Yeah. So some good chili right here, the uh, Lake Bruce Garage Chili. You got to get out here today and get some of that. Guys, thanks for being here every Thank year. You. Appreciate sure. it.
Take care. Nice talking to you. Thanks so much. Well, we've got a, uh, another team here for the chili cook-off this year. Who do we have with us? you got Putch Bar and Grill. Putch Bar and Grill. And who are you, sir? I'm Vaughn Ball. Excellent. Deborah Kingry. Excellent. So Putch Bar and Grill, you guys have done the chili before, right? I mean, the Putz has, I believe. Putz has, yeah. This is your first year, though? This is my first year. Yeah. And uh, I'm lost. I don't know what I'm doing, but I hope I do all right. You're wearing a cowboy hat. How hard could chili be if you're wearing a cowboy hat? If nothing That's else, what I, thought, I you know. figure you'll be all right. Well, so, I, I stand out anyway. You do. You do. <laughs> so you guys having fun this morning? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. What time did you get here? About 7.30? No. Oh, six. Six. Yeah, I was here at 6 o'clock setting up. You want good chili, you got to be here early. Early bird, Let me tell you. Worm. Absolutely. Well, thank you, guys. Thanks for Puss for being a part of this. We're glad to have you. And Hope you uh, sell some chili today. Oh, I'll try. All right. Well, thanks That's so it. much. You have a good day. You too, buddy. Thanks, folks. Yep. Hey, Scott Sager, we've got another young lady right here. What's your name? My name is Ashley Webb. Ashley, and who are we representing today? Putz Bell Bonds. Putz Bell Bonds. Hence, I'm behind bars for this. <laughs> you are. That's a great theme, my dear. So you've been out here before, right? Yeah, this is my third year doing okay. this for Putt. Great. So. You have fun doing it? Yeah, I do. Well, it's, it's a fun. great thing, and you guys always have fun with the booths and whatnots and yeah. little skeletons up here. I like those <laughs> this year. Well, thanks so much for you and your team being out here, and Thank we you. wish you the best today. Thank you. Thank thanks you. so much. Kenny, how you doing, buddy? How are you? You're getting skinny. Look at Thanks. you. How are Bryce. you? Good. Nice to meet this you. Bryce. Bryce, good to see you, buddy. We're going to look right there. Can you see me okay? Uh, yeah. yeah, maybe a little bit closer like that, right? Come on up. Stand up under here. Hey, Scott Sager, we've got another team, and uh, I, everybody knows this guy. This is Kenny from Kroger's. How you doing, Kenny? Good. How are you? I'm good, buddy. Who's our helper today? Bryce Calvert. Bryce. Bryce is the chili aficionado. So, uh... Kroger's. We knew that immediately when we saw you. All of these things can be purchased from your local Kroger's. They can. A lot of the stuff I know you used over the years is actually Kroger brand materials, yes. correct? Yes. Um, pretty much everything that we, ha actually everything we have this year, the tomatoes, the tomato juice, the beans, it, everything is all Kroger brand. Kroger brand. Even can't the beat it. And the cornbread. And I'm getting hungry just looking at it all. So you you don't have too many helpers. I've seen you with big crews in years. Yeah, before. this is a small crew this year. A lot of them had to work. Um, so we're just going to make it happen with the two of us. We've got some people that are popping in and out and helping, so that's good. Excellent, excellent. Kenny, well, thanks, Kroger's, for all you do, not only for the chili cook-off, but for the community. You guys are involved in everything. You're a great community member, and uh, we're just happy to have you here and uh, being a part of the chili cook-off. Well, thanks. We appreciate it. I mean you think about it you know we are part of the community too so you know it's good to give back to the community that comes in and shops with us to buy their groceries so just give it back to everybody giving back to the, the community is the best thing you can do well that's wonderful keep it up good luck today my friend with your inaugural year here hope you win some prizes today okay thanks Kroger's thanks, thanks Kenny Well, here we've got another crew, and these gals are grooving. <laughs> Who do I have here with us today? Marianne Miller, Laura Roberts. And we are representing? Grace United Methodist Church. Grace United Methodist Church. They're do always doing a great job with their decoration. You've won some awards for your decorations in the past, We right? have, yes. yes. So the theme <laughs> this year is the groove, right? Yes, <laughs> yes. Groovy Grace. So we Groovy yeah. Grace. I'm liking it. She's got not only rainbow sunglasses, but they're heart-shaped, so... <laughs> You fit the theme quite well here. I want to know where I can get some of these because I think they special went out order. special <laughs> order. Okay, off of Amazon, right? Well, Grace is doing such a great job in the community, especially especially with our youth here. You guys have a great uh, preschool program. Mm -hmm. You also have a great uh, I don't know getting the message out there to some of the mm -hmm. youth here. So yeah. mm -hmm. keep up that great work. But uh, <laughs> who inspired the groovy theme this year? Um, it just kind of came to yeah. me, yeah. It came to me in a dream, man. Yeah. Yeah. My dream catcher caught that dream That's and I made awesome, it a reality. Man. That's groovy. <laughs> hey, well, thank you ladies so much and you and your team and everybody for all they're doing. Thank yes, you. Thank you. Okay, I'll see you. Hey, Scott Sager, we've got another booth here. you got to recognize these faces, but I'll let them introduce themselves as I chase away some uh, bees here. They're hiding. Uh, Andrea Steinbach, I'm the director. Sorry. Director of the library. <laughs> director of the library. No longer interim director. We're talking full-fledged. She's got the plaque. 
It's true. Yeah, yeah. I yeah. got rid of that interim a that's while. That's right. That's right. And we've got this young man. Everybody knows him. Yep. I'm uh, the literacy director, Tim. Unless you ask the kids, I'm the guy that does their homework for them. They are lying parents. I do not do their homework for them. Yeah. <laughs> That's fun. Well, Tim Rowe, of course, in charge of literacy here in Fulton County with the library, doing a great job with that. We've got a chili team here out, uh, out today. What kind of inspired the group to do this? Have you done this in years past? Oh uh, yeah, we've done this for many years. Okay, so they're one of the, you know, charter members going to do this until the cows come home, so to speak. Chili today, vegetarian chili. Is it beef chili? You got spicy. You got both. What do you got today? Well, we got a unique chili. Uh, it's not inspired by me, though. I am a vegetarian. Okay. This is actually a vegan chili. Oh wow! So we spent some time actually researching some recipes. We uh, and and we found a, you know a website at top hundred best. Yeah. You know, and then we ended up going all the way through. And this was Martha Stewart. This one Martha Stewart's <laughs> best. You can't, go, you can't go wrong when you're using Martha Stewart. No, it was me. Margaret Stewart. Stewart. Margaret. Yeah, Margaret. <laughs> Margaret. Not Martha. Not Martha and Snoop Dogg. Yeah. No, this is Margaret. Yeah, this is just some lady that lives somewhere. somewhere out in Talma, I think. I don't know, but she put out a magazine, and this is her chili. So I love it. I love thank it. You, well, Margaret. Well, uh, you're probably going to be one of the only vegan chilies out it's here. It's true. Today. We probably are. All right. So, the library, always spicing it up, so to speak. So keep up the good work, you two, thank and all your crew. Thanks for being a part of this today. Thank you. Thank you. See you. We're going all out of here today. This is great. I love this. Hey. Hey. Well, Scott Sager here, RTC TV4. I'm a lifeguard all of a sudden. I'm enjoying that. Oh, no, Scott. Uh, oh, oh, no, Scott. You're being saved. You're being saved. Well, I need that, too, for sure. So we're out here at Woodlawn Hospital. Who am I talking with? Hi, my name's Brenda Carlson. Brenda, you guys are doing a great job. I love the theme this year. Talk to me a little bit about the chili. What kind of chili we got today? Fantastic chili. Oh, yeah. Fantastic chili. Well, very good. Well, we love it when Woodlawn's out here. We thank you so much for being a part of this. Oh, no problem. Let Woodlawn save you any day. Well, recognize this guy from Woodlawn. He's the chaplain out there, right? Thank you. Yep. Mr. Jason, Jason C. Thank you. So I, you, you can introduce me now, too. <laughs> no, I'm sorry. Jason C. here with us, doing a lot for this community. Jason, now, do you pastor as well somewhere? Nope. I'm full-time on staff at the hospital. Full-time out there. And, uh, you know, just helping people get connected to... Yes to a church or a faith or whatever, you know, whatever's important to them. Yeah, so. absolutely. Yeah. Well, much needed uh, faith in the hospital for sure as that happens. So, well, thank you for being a part of the team. Yeah. Are you enjoying yourself so hey, far? Hey, this is a good group. Good group to work with and good group to hang out with. Seemed so. like a lot of fun. Well, thanks for Woodlawn for all they're doing. We enjoy having you guys here in the community and all you do for us. And here you are out at Ch Chili Cook-Off. So enjoy yourselves Enjoy today. some chili. That's right. All right, buddy. Thank, thank you. you. We've got another chili group here. Let's talk the names first. Chelsea, Whitney, Jessica, John. And what group are we representing today? Uh, mixed Medium Design. Excellent. That's uh, marketing graphic design, graphic right? Design, yep. Excellent. Well, good luck with that. You're right here in Rochester, right? I am, yes. Way to be out uh, part of the community, yeah, doing the community well. thing with the chili. Yeah. Let's uh, feature this guy back here for a second. <laughs> Now this is his normal Saturday attire. This is not just for the chili. <laughs> We're having fun with John and the guys here. So uh, talk to us about your chili itself. Uh, you got some special recipe, putting in crazy ingredients. Is it gonna be sweet? Is it gonna be spicy? All right, it actually tastes a little more like Mexican okay. chili. It's okay. like a taco soup, yeah, but yeah. it's a chili and uh, it's my mom's recipe. Nice. So I've been making it for a while. So Excellent. I'm pretty confident Excellent. in it, yeah. Well, I'll have to sneak back by and get a taste of that. I want to thank you all for being a part of this for sure. Yeah. It's a big event, as you can see. We've got thousands of people downtown here. So uh, enjoy your time making your chili. I'll let you get back to that so you're all ready right. for the 11 o'clock kickoff, okay? All right, all right. Thank thanks. Thanks, everybody. <laughs> hey. Well, we've got another group here. I recognize that name as, and uh, some of these faces. They've actually seen these pretty whites more than once. In fact, they're the reason that they're still pretty white. So. <laughs> We're glad to be here with Fraunfelter Dental Clinic, or dental care, right? How do we call it? Clinic, Clinic yeah. Clinic, <laughs> care, Fraunfelter, just say DJ, just say Dr. Bill, you'll be fine. They know who you're talking about. Well, let's go around and do introductions. Who do we have over here? Uh, my name is Taylor. Jenna. Michaela. Dustin. JD. Morgan. Excellent, folks. So, whose idea for the cool theme? 
would yeah. Morgan. Morgan. Yeah. It was a group effort. Yeah. Okay, nobody wants to take credit, but it was really Morgan. She did it. Nice job. <laughs> Proud of you, Morgan. So, uh, have you guys had a team every year? Is this first year? What's going on? Third year, I think. Yeah, we did it on. two yeah. years ago and then a couple of years before that. A little so. off and on, but yeah. you're here this year, yeah. which is what matters. We've got more teams than ever before, so it's a very exciting time. So, uh, tell us about your chili itself. Hot, spicy, very mild. It's a white chili. Tell us about it. It's a traditional red chili. Okay. It's got, a got a little kick to it. Got a little kick. Scotty likes a little kick in the secret ingredient but okay. right. secret it's a ghost pepper be afraid be very afraid now we're having fun today so thank you very much from felters dental clinic right here in rochester taking care of patients since i don't know when i was this tall <laughs> so uh, they're doing a great job for us thanks for being out here today folks thank you. Thanks. everybody's running from me when they get the camera out but this one didn't run so i grabbed a hold over here we're with what, Split Road Media, the melting pot. Tell me what's going we are. on here. So, uh, so actually, I'm friends with Bryce. Okay, Bryce Hardesty. Bryce Hardesty, and so he came up with the theme. I came up with the recipe. Okay. Right. So our all of our ingredients are from local businesses. Oh, no kidding. So we have the cheese from Snobble Tears. Nice. We've got the jalapeno sausage from Townsend's. We've got from the. Uh, Farmer's Market over there, we have onions and some ground beef. I love it. Uh, what am I missing? Oh, from the newest business in town, the Black Beans. Yeah. Uh, from the Uncorked. Uncorked, yes. And I don't and think the I'm... beer? Oh, yep, the beer we got from the dam. Just yeah. a little bit of every... Look at all you can do I when you stay not. local. That's right! I love it! Living it local. All right, you guys win my award for you that alone. Uh, oh, yeah. From what? The Reapers are from Bryce. He, bought, he uh, grew those. This is the hottest. Reaper pre peppers? Reaper. Holy cow. 100 times hotter than a habanero. We should do a contest of just somebody trying to survive that. Right, no. <laughs> Nobody under 18 gets any of my sauce. Right, right. Well, thank you guys so yeah, much. We got you. Glenn Goss back here doing right. a great job. Everybody doing a great job here at Split Road Media. Thanks so much. The melting pot is a great idea. We're here at another booth, and uh, we've got a common theme. It's the jail today. Who am I talking with? Uh, Pastor Curtis May. Yeah, from uh, St. John's Lutheran Church. That's right. We've uh, we've met three times, and each time it's been here at the Chili Cook-Off. Yes, it has. Yes. <laughs> You're doing a great job. Thank you so much. What's this guy doing over here? Anybody Hi, Scott. recognize him? How are you? I'm good. How are you, Sheriff Sailors? Good. Good, good, good. Well, this is an official badge. This one, not so much, right? Well... Kind of, sort of. Kind of, sort of, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, the Lutheran Church out here, right? Yeah. We've got uh, another beautiful theme, and I see you did uh, the steeple with uh, some stained glass in it this year. Yeah, yeah. We got law and gospel here. So he arrests them, we forgive them. Law and gospel. I like the theme. That's very clever. You've been clever all three years. You know that, right? Oh, we try anyways. <laughs> God is with us. It's, a, it's that divine inspiration that does I it I think for you, so, right? yes. Okay, very good. <laughs> Sheriff Sailors, what's your affiliation? You a member of this church? No. Um, we have several members of the church that have been law enforcement okay. and uh, the FOP Lodge, local lodge. Yeah. Um, we've, we kind of joined forces with the church and thought it would be a good idea. And and we're promoting what the FOP does here in the community with uh, the shop with the cop yeah, and, absolutely. and that. So. Well, you guys are doing great work, keeping us safe, but doing more and going well above that. So thank you for all that. Thank you. One more thing yeah. is that we are working together on mental health and addiction. Okay. And I, so we have a pretty good sized group that's doing a lot for the community and hopefully uh, the community will get to see this soon. Yeah, absolutely. That's good news. That's good news. Mental health been uh, kind of shoved to the side for many, many years, and a lot of people paying attention to it now. So I'm glad you guys are involved in being proactive with that. So thank you again for you and everybody at the church doing what they're doing. Thanks for being out here today for a great community event. All right. Thank you. All right, God's guys. blessings. Thanks. Thanks. You can get in here. I can work around you. Let me do this. Well, Scott Sager here. I'm with the group from Walmart today. Let's go around and get some names. Dave Benzing. Over here. Sherry Hester. Back here. Oh, Becky Zeiger. They can't see through the masks. Tisha Hester. Tom Hathaway. As Spock. As Spock. I love it. I love it. Well, uh, Walmart, have you guys been out here every year? Is this the first year for you? What's been happening? 
This is our eighth year. Eighth year, so uh, a veteran of the chili cook-off. Have you guys won ever? Uh, three times. Three times, my gosh, a three-time winner. I should have done all my prep work before I came in, right? <laughs> so eight years, three champions here. I love to hear that. Who came up with the theme this year? Kind of a Dave. group effort? Yeah, yeah, Dave did. Out of this world. Okay, yeah. I like it. I like it a lot. Well, we're so glad Walmart's in this community. You guys do a lot. You benefit a lot. Do a lot of great things for the community. So we're glad you're out here for this chili cook-off today. Thank you. I love the theme. I love the costumes. You guys have some fun, okay? Yep. Thank you. Thanks, Thanks so Thank much. You. Well, now we've got a, a group of friendly faces. We've got the Rochester Middle School football team out here for the chili cook-off. We're going to pass the mic around a little bit and get some introductions. We'll start over here. Uh, I'm Maverick. I'm Jarrett. I'm Antonio. I'm Sean. I'm Faith. I'm Aaron. I'm Gabe. Right here. I'm Taylor. I'm Carlos. I'm Carolina. I'm Reese. Excellent. Okay, so. Chili, who's making the chili? You guys or your parents? All of us. It's a team effort. They're a football team. They do things together, right? Yeah. yeah. Excellent. So whose idea was it to do the chili team? Mine. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Our coaches. They're pointing back to the coaches who helped them out with it. Well, have you had fun? You guys had to get here early this morning, didn't you? Yeah. yeah. Uh, what time did you get here? Six. Eight. Eight. Six a.m. I was still sleeping. I'm just telling you. I was still sleeping. So uh, your first year to do the chili cook-off, right? Yeah. Okay. Is this one of your coaches back here? Yeah. Well, let's make him get on TV, too. Right. I know. They hate it when I do that. But you're kind of the inspiration. What's your name? Uh, Bill Allen. Football coach, right? 7th, yeah. 8th grade? 7th, eighth grade. Seventh, eighth grade. Excellent. And you were one of the inspirations for doing this? I don't know about the inspiration, but I'm the one that got <laughs> to do it. He said yes. <laughs> Never say yes. No, no. It's a great event. You guys have a great booth. A lot of fun. It was a lot of work, though, wasn't it? Yeah. 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 We're ready to work. to win. What? We're ready to win. We're ready to win. I like this guy. You had to work as a team, too, didn't you? Everybody had their role, right? Yeah. Just like on a football team. Hey, thanks so much. Good luck to you today. Hope to get to taste some of your chili, okay? Thank you. Thanks, everybody. Thank you. Well, we've got another booth right here for you. Who do we have? Christy Overdorf. Christine Calvert. Jadlyn Calvert. Cindy Miller. Cindy Miller. And over here? Katie Wright. Hey, how about you? Tracy Fincher. Tracy Fincher? Yep. Excellent. Well, thank you all for being a part of this. Now, what's the group? Lakeside Kitchen. Lakeside Kitchen. Where's that at? It's on Niona Lake. Okay. Just had a recent open house, correct? Yes, we did. Excellent. So, down at Niona Lake, Lakeside Kitchen. What kind of food can I expect at the Lakeside Kitchen? We serve um, American cuisine, comfort food, great steaks, and a great salmon. You know, it's only 11 o'clock, but I'm getting hungry already. Between the chili and talking about steaks, I'll tell you what, you're open till 2? We're open till 2 today. 2 no, p.m.? No, today we're open till 11. Tomorrow yeah. we'll be open till 2. 11 okay. p.m.? No. 11 a.m.? Mm -hmm. We okay. closed early for the chili cook-off. Oh, today. I got you. Okay, very good. That makes sense. Well, uh, so, who's inspiration for the theme this year, or was this just kind of a group effort? Um, just because we're on a lake, so it makes sense to have a lake theme. I think so, too. Good idea, good idea. Talk to me about the chili. Is it a hot chili? Is it a spicy chili? Is it a vegan chili? What it's is it? It's very, very flavorful. It's got um, a variety of different spices, and um, it is gluten-free. Gluten-free chili. Scotty could use some of that, I'll tell you what. Well, thank you so much for being a part of this. You guys, best of luck with the business down there. Maybe we'll much. get down there and get some more interviews uh, with the folks who are actually eating your food down there at Niona Lake, okay? okay? Thanks thank so you. much. Thanks, Appreciate God. it, ladies. Hey, Scott Sager, we've got another group here with the Chili Cook-Off again. Record numbers this year for Chili entries. This entry is Pace Setters Real Estate right here in Rochester. And West Side Services. And West Side Services. Don't want to forget that. <laughs> What's your name, dear? Shelly Bailey. Ron Gundrum. Matt Steininger. Excellent. Now, have you guys done this before? Or is this your first, first year? First year. Excellent. Mm -hmm. Inaugural year. Talk to me about the chili a little bit. You going with the spicy chili? You going with the sweet chili? What you got? A little spicy. A little spicy. Yeah. Got a little kick to it. A little bit. That's little what bit. I like. That's what I like. <laughs> so pace setters going well for you guys. Doing great here in Rochester. Very sure. good. Yeah. Well, Very good. We love our local businesses, local real estate, local everything. So we're glad you're here. We appreciate all you're doing. Thanks for being a part of the community uh, event today. Yeah. Thank yeah. you. Thank you for all you do too. Best of luck. Very good. Thank you. Well, we've got uh, another 
chilly entry here today. We've got Hickory Creek, correct? Yes. yes. Hickory name? Creek at Rochester. Robin Ewing. Robin. Bob. Roger Spillman. Excellent. Well, thank you so much for being a part of this today. We've seen some wanted themes today. I think Chile inspires Southwest, which of course inspires the old ideas of the Old West, which then gets you the old gunman and the uh, and the wanted and the and the uh, badges and whatnot. So I'm seeing a lot of that today. Talk to me specifically about what kind of inspired that for you guys. Um, I'm going to the lady. You know, she's the one with all the answers. You've basically said it all. Ours is Hickory Creek Chuck Wagon Chili. And Roger is our dietary manager and made our chili, so he can tell you all about it. Um, we just wanted everybody to get to know us and be a part of the community. Yeah, absolutely. What a great day for that, too. As I walk around, I'm seeing people who I've had names of but hadn't met personally from the community doing various things. So it's a great opportunity for that. Let's talk about the chili a little bit. The dietitian back here, talk to me. What did we put in this? Anything spicy? Is it gonna? Is it going to pep me up? Is it sweet? The, ch the chili is, is mellow because okay. I have children who come up and they've sampled that they wanted some. So I got to look out for the younger folks as well as the sure. older folks. Sure. Um, it's just an old recipe that I had with my parents and I've tweaked it here and there and won a few awards with it. So we're going to see how it turns out today. Uh, he's got uh, award winning family recipe here today, folks. So glad you guys are here. Glad you're putting it all together. Hickory Creek doing great things for Fulton County. So thank you guys for being a part of this today.